Howdy folks, how are y'all doing? My name is Reese, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Syndicate where I got my Syndicate shirt back. Well, it's a general uh, Assassin's Creed shirt. It doesn't say anything specific about Syndicate. It's a nice shirt though. You don't want to know what I had to go through to find it. Oh my goodness, what a... Uh, let's just say a part of my soul will never be returned to me. Now, last time I was very distracted by performance. Some of you will remember I kept looking over, noting that GPU was maxed out, which is fine. That's what you want. It means your computer's not being bottlenecked. Uh, it, it, well, if this GPU is maxed out, that means the GPU is the bottleneck, but it's not being bottlenecked by anything else, and I have a 1080 Ti, so for right now, I mean, unless I want to throw a couple of Titan XP's in there, uh, it, uh, in SLI, that's just, that's the only really improvement we, we're gonna get, so 1080 Ti is good enough. Uh, some, some things have changed, CPU was b b maxing out last time, which I thought was affecting performance uh, recording quality, but now... Now I think it's this game. Now I now I'm I'm starting to think Assassin's Creed games just don't record well because maybe they're just not well optimized games. Maybe that explains why we started having trouble with every Assassin's Creed game at some point. I mean, maybe even the first one we had to start jumping around trying to find different programs. I, I had to record it with Fraps. Fraps, a program I never want to use nor recommend anyone using, but I had to use that because it was the only way to capture the first game. Uh, and then the fourth game wouldn't work with anything besides Shadow Play, and then you know how I feel about Shadow Play. It's a great program, but it's not the best program. I'm using OBS right now. I've got the NVENC codec, which is the actual video processor that's on the graphics card, which is what Shadow Play uses. That's what we're using right now in OBS. We're sitting at 60 FPS right now in OBS until I move the camera around, and then it kind of dips. Look. We're sitting at 43% CPU usage. The CPUs might have had some changes uh, since last time. That's how the... Anyway, whatever happens today is what happens today. I fiddled around with some settings going into this. It looks like potato. Well... Alright, so I actually went around the city a bit and uh, got some chests and things. I had to restart this mission from the beginning, but we're back into it. In our midst. This is where we left off, I think. And she knows their methods. Follow her directions as you would my own. Yes, oh, sir. okay then. We're going. Now listen, there's a little... So, then it's our duty. Yeah, there... There was a side thing we could do. But I guess we're not going to do that. Why do I keep hitting I that button? Can we recruit all of them? Come along, lads! Follow me! We're going into battle! Through one of these doors. Not that one, though. Maybe this one up here, because we can pick the lock on this one. Wait, we already did that, didn't we? Oh, okay. Well, that's weird. I'm pretty sure I... Didn't I have to pick the lock on that one last time? I don't think that I would have saved that, because I actually left the mission, ran around London, got some, like, chests and stuff, and then came back. But also, who cares? You guys ready? Let's go! We're off to stab Lucy, off to stab Lucy Thorn. I hear she is a thorn of a thorn, if ever a Lucy Thorn there was. If ever, if ever the thorn there was, a Luthy Thorn is one because, 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 because of the horrible things she does. Da, 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 da. We're off to kill Lucy, the horrible Lucy Thorn. I don't know what this song is, I don't. I just started clobbering people and felt like a song was needed. How are we doing, guys? We're doing excellent. Good. None of you have, have... Have any of you died? I can't tell. Everyone here kind of looks the same. Come on! Let's kill them all! No, actually... Uh, upstairs! There's more upstairs! Let's kill them all! Um, hold on. I can take care of these guys. No, I can't. I think I took care of one of them? It was hard to tell. I think I definitely killed at least one of them, though. Good job. Is it just the... Is it just the three of us? Oh, my. We're not gonna make it very far if I like, like, keep letting them die. What is that? Is that like a bomb or something? Or is someone just clocking me in the face and causing that to happen? All right, come on, we're real close. There's three of them around this corner, and there's three of us, so... Oh, no. Whoa! Whoa! Hey, come on, guys. Come on. It's the three of us versus the three of them. Let's go! All right, listen, do we need to psych ourselves up or anything? Wait, why is everybody else... I see more blue dots downstairs. Are those our guys? What are they doing? Do, why, why won't they come and fight with us? Oh, wait, no, hold on. Maybe they're further up? I don't know. Look, it's, it's not important. 3v3, this is sort of like at the end of the Star Wars, where the, the Obi-Wan and the Anakin fought, and then the, the, the Senate fought the Yoda. It's just like that, except for there's one extra group. I don't know. Palpatine versus Anakin's ex. I don't know. Come on, guys! Yeah! 
I'm doing all of your work for you. I I'm doing a real good job of it, too. Like, never, no one ever say that Eevee didn't do anything here, because I'm pretty much doing it all. They're just kind of loosely shooting at- wait, who are these guys? Where did they go? Oh, was that Lucy? Oh, I think I've- oh, this is Lucy. Oh, I killed everybody. We've done it. I haven't recorded in a few days. I'm a little bit out of practice. How is the frame rates, though? It says 60 FPS right now. So, you have murdered me after all. But what good will that do you? <laughs> Bit of coffee. Not mine. Ours. You are so short-sighted. You'd hoard power and never use it when we would better the condition of humanity. I hope you never find the shroud. You have no idea what it truly can do. Why is my shirt like crooked? Tell me then. Oh, come on, Ocelot. I think that might be the last time we get to say that. Why was she called the Occultist? Nothing she did was very cult-like. I don't get it. The Ocelot was a better name because of that cat fight in the last episode. Her and Evie were getting into it. Evie's real precise. Somehow she's still lost. Do we need to make a grand escape? Because I'm pretty sure that we're the good guys here. What's up with the music? Can I Can I loot the corpses? You're gonna hold off who for as long as you can? Look, you're talking like I'm the bad guy and I'm gonna be in trouble. Who's this other guy? Hey, he wasn't one of the we three warriors who went and took down- Oh, whoa! Whoa, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I was trying to loot a corpse. Alright, you know what? Maybe I should leave. Should probably definitely leave, actually. Is there another way out of here? Maybe in the direction of this green thing? Why are they- what? what are, I, did, I didn't do anything. Why are they shooting at me? I'm the good guy! What is this? How high is this tower? Where am I trying to get to? Oh, wow, it's chaos. Yeah, you guys get him. Whoa, hold on, Evie. Hold on, Evie. Before we climb down this wall, turn around for a second. Oh, yeah, boy! The sliding technique is just fantastic. This really speeds up the game. I hope that they have this in Origins. I doubt that they will, though. It looks like they're stripping Origin way back. And it doesn't make sense for him to have magic Spider-Man powers in Origins since it is an older game. But it wouldn't have been- it wouldn't be the first time the game showed, like, some level of inconsistency, would it? Really? Come on. Come on. Get over to the boat. Okay. That- that's not what I wanted you to do, but I guess that's good enough. Look out for that- look out for that cart there, Evie. I don't think my settings were transferred over in the cloud when I had to re-download the game to this fresh copy of Windows. Uh, alright. I mean, CPU keeps- uh, the FPS keeps dropping down to, like, 50-something, but... We, at least we, we did the thorn in our side quest, right? You know what I mean? Small successes, small victories. Take this down. Then I want it sealed until you receive further orders. Miss Thorn. You supplied me with the means to secure London's future. The city thanks you. The order thanks you. I thank you. But the shroud can only be worn by one. Therefore, I hereby dissolve this partnership. I promise to endow you with an income into your old age. I guess that, that he doesn't know the father of that she's very dead. Yes, what is it? Miss Thorne, sir. What of her? I'm sorry, sir. She is dead. And the key. Where is the key? There was no key found on her body, sir. Find the key, find the key, find the beautiful key, find the key, find the key, and how happy you'll be. It's a song. I mean, you were about to fire her, so... The shroud will be mine, even if I have to raise hellfire to do it. Burn the letter. I mean, I understand that he's not happy about losing the key, but really, we've done him a service here. He was going to fire her, and then he'd have to pay her to, like, live out the rest of her days, which back then, I guess, wouldn't have been that long. But still, 
in the grand scheme of things, he's getting off a lot easier than he was going to otherwise, and I just feel like we need some sort of a, a, a payment for that. Maybe. Like, I, I don't know, maybe if he wants to send us... He's a pretty wealthy man, he pretty much runs London, England is my city, get that SEO in there. Maybe he can just send us a nice shrimp dinner or something. Shrimp aren't that expensive, but they're, they're too expensive for me. I'm a, I'm a cheap boy. All right then, Evie, we got one more mission before uh, the end of the sequence here, I think. Actually, no, hold on. That might not be correct. Also, if you didn't understand what I just said, that's fine. Neither did I. I was going for, like, an accent, and then it just went way overboard into the depths of just nonsense. Oh, no, we were in the right spot. Right here. Here we go. Evie visits Southwark after Jacob assassinated Pearl and shut down her omnibus company. It's all coming together. All the storylines are melding. It's like if you took a turtle and then a shell and you fused them together, you'd get a mutant, mutant ninja team. Something like that. What is happening to the frame rate? Oh, this looks awful. Oh, why, game? Literally nothing is being maxed out right now. Nothing is being overtaxed. I'm looking at all of it. Wait, how did we get how did we get in a vehicle? I got a bit distracted there. Get up, oh me charge. Oh good, we're up to 60 now. Good. We're, we're <laughs> now that the game has started and we're riding some carts through the streets of London, frame rate's locked in at 60 again. And let's be careful not to uh wreck into this guy. So, which button do I push to ram? Ah, I'm sorry, sir. Did not mean to do that, I promise you. I'm definitely on your side here. Alright, I don't know how, but we've gotten everyone ahead of him now. So he's pretty much fine. And if Evie will just reload her gun, I think we can shoot these guys? Yeah, or at least shoot in their direction. Hold on! Alright, get on his- Yes! Now we've got it! Ha ha! Gonna get you now! Hold still. Hold on, no, listen. It's hard to hit a moving target. Stop moving! Thank you! Oh, good grief. Get back in Edward's cart to continue. I don't want to drive. Wait, why do I have to drive? Wait, was I supposed to be doing that the whole time? So I thought I was being real clever when I jumped on his roof, like I'd broken the game. This guy's having some sort of a breakdown. Well, yeah, Jacob's constantly putting the world in peril. I guess we're never going to finish that conversation. As good as it sounded, she just stopped talking. It, it sounded like it was going to be like, Mr. Bailey, I'll help you out. But I honestly don't know what's happening now. Also, this horse is in the way, and I guess I'm finding a deed. I'm just going to, you know, using contextual clues, I'm going to assume that we agreed to help him get our hands on the deed. Or get his hands. We're going to get his hands on the deed by first putting our hands on them. Laying hands on the deed, getting our grubby little dirty fingers on them. Uh, put on some lipstick and like give it a nice kiss right on top of it and then give it over to our buddy Henry in the train because we apparently have some sort of a thing going on with him. Evie's got a daddy issue and a thing for older men and she's real precise like that. How do I get what, how do I get inside of here? I've been in here before. Oh, look at that. An opening. Wonderful. <laughs> Whoa, calm down there, Evie. Uh, stealth is health as they say in the medical field. Hey, why is he running? Why is he running? He's got literally no way of knowing that I'm here. Where is he going? I've been completely... He's, he's at the front door, isn't he? He's headed up the... Where, where is he going? No, he's still inside the building. Oh, but he's not going to be for long. Oh, gosh, he's outside. All right, come on, Evie. we got to catch this guy now. Surely he was safer in the building surrounded by people. Why did, why did he leave the building surrounded by his people to be killed in the streets? 
It makes no sense. It says to steal, can I kill him? It certainly makes stealing a lot easier, unless I'm supposed to steal him. That would probably be kidnapping, though. Not Grand Theft Person. Um, good job, Evie. Good, you've done good. Let's go find that guy. Okay. I sent Rossman a message. You and your family are safe. <gasps> you are blooming brilliant. Why does the frame rate go to crap when we get into a cutscene of all things? General Omnibus Company. Good moral men. All of them. Is that why they're all dressed like Abraham Lincoln? Thank you, Miss Fry. You betcha. My pleasure. All right. Well, I guess we've we're helping. I like this. Uh, this. 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 Like dynamic they've got where. Jacob destroys industry and then Evie helps rebuild it in the private sector. That's real great. A bad penny. Interesting. Very interesting. What's a bad penny? Is it one that's gotten all like corroded and turned to green? Have you ever seen that? You know what I'm talking about? Where you get the penny and it's, it's, it's almost like there's a film of growth on the top of it. Like it's gotten moldy, but it's not. It's just oxidizing or whatever pennies do. They might not oxidize. They might corrode. They don't rust. I've never seen a rusting penny. I don't think that that metal is. Are they are they made of zinc? If I'm not mistaken, I think zinc oxidizes over time. They're not made of copper. If you think that pennies are made of copper, you're delusional. That would be too expensive. A penny's worth of copper, like a, a penny-sized piece of copper, is way more than a single cent. In fact, I think even the zinc that we use for pennies is still like the raw materials are worth more. So if you ever want to break U.S. law and just melt down some pennies, I mean, yes, you could risk some jail time. But at the end of it, you'd have a nice pile of zinc you could go sell. Who's going to buy zinc from you, though? <laughs> Maybe you could sell it back to the treasury so they can make new pennies. Oh, that'd be amazing. It's like, I've got 63 pennies worth of zinc here. Um, all right, we don't know where you got it from, but that's worth at least a dollar. Yeah, boy. Now, wait a minute. Is this an actual Eevee assassination, not a, not a Jacob one? Because dadgummit, I think Evie would be perfect for an assassination mission. Because she's real precise. Uh, Jacob prepares to enter the Bank of England. Stop a robbery and eliminate two penny. Oh, so this is a Jacob mission? I see that this is, in fact, a Jacob mission. That's why we dissolved. That That's how that works. When you're twins, only one of you can do with a single thing at a time. So what you have to do is you have to dissolve so that your counterpart can well, evolve. I'll tell you. You're not gonna like it. No, see here. I am graced with the Abilene family's robust constitution. Two pennies, Robin. Twenty-two <laughs> FPS during cutscenes. It doesn't make any sense. The video engine is at a, a crippling twenty percent. CPUs at a total of forty-nine percent usage. Of course, but do you know how I can get in? I don't know, folks. I just don't know. What? We're, oh, we're breaking into the Bank of England? Are we going to steal the Jade Buddha? Fortress, guarded under lock and key. Guys, it's the start of Around the World in 80 Days of the Assassin's Creed! Just like I wanted! Wait, is this jittery too? Am I jittery right now? The entrance. Oh, yes. One man keeps a close watch on the vault door. He watches it like a hawk. If he sees you, he's sure to seal it. The guard captain, Gus Howard, knows Tupini well. He is in on this, I'm certain. Mr. Fry, please use discretion. The only way to implicate Tupini is to catch him in the act. Do not jeopardize him. No big displays. This is the Bank of England. Well, then why don't we have Evie doing this? In disguise. Of course. Of course. Tupini won't be leaving that vault. Well, Jacob sounds sure of it. Guess we're about to find out. Oh, this for the frame rate hasn't gone back up yet. It, it's sitting at like 40. It keeps dropping down to 20. Why is this happening? Why? Maybe if I like pause and go back? Okay, maybe maybe it'll go back by itself. 
just to clarify for anyone who's confused, we're talking about OBS's frame rate. It, it lists its recording frame rate right next to CPU usage, which is sitting at 7.4%. <laughs> The end game is definitely running 60 FPS. It's beautifully smooth. It's right on the money. I don't know why it's not running like that in OBS. Because again, we're using NVENC and it's using the video buffer and, I'm sorry, the video engine. Um, I mean, it's it's not taxing that. The CPU's not being taxed. I don't know, y'all. Alright, so we got someone down there it looks like we can talk to. Who are you, good sir? The Vault Watcher. Killing him will keep the Vault opened. He closes the Vault door at the first sign of trouble. Kill the Vault Watcher. Well, Vault Watcher's got to die. Na, 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 na. Goodbye, bank manager. Easy Vault access. Guards will move to let the manager inside. Kidnap the bank manager. All right, so we've got our plans. Kidnap and kill. Those are two very... Well, they're not very different. I'd argue they're, they're pretty similar. Who is that? What do we need to do to them? Uh, unlocks unique kill. Must know two pennies weakness. I don't know what two pennies weaknesses are, but well, wait, are you suggesting that he does? Okay. Dad gummit! What? There's no way they saw me! No, no way at all! Come on now, game! Let's not be ridiculous. Well, I failed to kill that- or kidnap that guy. That said, though, I'm doing pretty well. Like, I think I might actually have the opportunity to kill everyone here. Got like a 32 combo. How high do these combos go? Huh! I killed them all. Every last one of them. Not just the men, but the women. And the children. They were like bank guards, and I slaughtered them like bank guards. Shut up. I don't suppose you got a key or anything, do you? No. Okay, that's fine. So we don't really need that guy to open this thing. We can just open it ourselves. Hi, guys. How are y'all doing? Disregard me and all the dead people. It's not a big deal. What are we doing in here? Are we robbing the vault? Or are we trying to steal some information? Or Oh. We're trying to get there. Gotcha. Guys, OBS is reporting... Whoa! What the heck? It was reporting 30 FPS, and then all of a sudden it decided to report 60. Something about going downstairs here made it lock in... A There's got to be something happening on the computer. There's got to be some sort of process. I've, I've got it set uh, in OBS to high priority, and I've got it in the task manager set to high priority as well. I mean, there's no higher priority you can set it to. I think I've got it set to real time. And I've tried with other priorities. I've tried balancing different things. It doesn't seem to make a difference. Perfect, we've done it. A couple of knife throws to the back and uh, bada boom, bada boom. I am really concerned about these frame rates. It's at 60 now. For some reason, this one's running at 60. From the people of London. Those animals squander their savings. We are the experts in investment. Nothing would be built or improved. Nothing would rise above the muck without our hand guiding. No creating the future. They benefit as much as they're worth. It is their city, not yours. Without our investments, there would be no city. For the path of the dead. Top ends. <laughs> Intense. I can't wait to see what we're collecting on this blood floor. Like, there's got to be a reason. We've got to have some sort of really gross... Oh, hi there. How are you doing? I guess we're starting a new combo here. If there's only the three of these guys, we might as well go ahead and kill all of them. That will make the escape a lot easier if we're not, like, running from people constantly. Apparently, I'm not meant to be escaping. I'm meant to be finding a secret passage that's very clearly marked. Which certainly makes finding the secret passage a lot easier. But, you know. Yeah, I left the restricted area. Now what? I'm here. Show me the... Oh. I bet you we have to turn this wheel. Maybe not. Because we can't actually interact with it? Okay, what was what was the point of this? There's there's nothing over here. 
Uh, maybe we have to kill everyone first. I mean, the game doesn't say that, but it's at the point where I'm just willing to try anything, you know? Ah, look at this. Now, this isn't it, though, because the secret passage was over there. That's what the game told us a second ago. I don't know what this is. Oh, okay. So the clearly marked thing was not the secret passage. Good, good job, game, I guess. You've made it marginally more difficult to put us in this... Wait, escape the area? What, what am I actually trying to do? What's the purpose of being here? What is going on? Oh, I get it. The game wants me to escape up this way. What about that chest? Where is it at? Like, in relation to where I am right now. Oh, it's, it's on the other side of this... Well, Shrek. Oh. Boom! Wall eject. And, uh, are they still after us? Or can I go over here and get this chest? Shut up! I just want the chest! Go ahead and pick that lock. We've got time. No, we don't. Alright. Oh, that gummit. I oh, was almost a clean headshot too, man. Just get in that chest. Come on, boy. I do kind of miss the little mini game from uh, Unity, but that's probably the only thing I miss from Unity. Get me out of this building, Jacob! I grow weary of being inside of here. Get me back outside where the frame rates work. There's like a fragment thing situation around here somewhere that I can't actually see. Ah, is that it right there? That's it right there. I think I see how we have to get it as well. Oh, cool. Well, I guess we finished the mission. By accident. I was trying to climb to the top of the building to get a fragment thing, but... Oh, that's what's happening. The Bank of England is closed until further notice. Very good job. They didn't get the Jade Buddha. I'll be honest, I've got no idea what was happening throughout that entire mission. I was not paying enough attention to the intro. I, I thought we were robbing the bank for some reason, for like legal purposes, but no, we were actually protecting the bank. And we did not get a Jade Buddha, which is very disappointing. But, the currency, uh, a laughing stock. Inflation out of control. Tupany brutally murdered. And yet Parliament does nothing. The bill will be defeated, sir. That buffooned Israeli shall be taken care of. It has been arranged, upon my honor. Your honor carries little weight. How dare you, sir! The poor people of this city have suffered enough. Today I granted a significant rise to my staff in order to counter inflation. What? I would supply all of London if I could. Meanwhile, you sit in your club and wax poetic with promises your honor cannot pay. Your family's fortune, however. I wonder what they would offer to keep your record out of the newspapers. About the same as Disraeli would offer for your balls, I'd wager. But let's be generous. Why limit ourselves to one or the other? And we can have it all. What say you, sir? <laughs> Shall I come collect? No more dallying. The halls of Parliament must be free to govern. Again. Understood? You may see yourself out. I think this might be like the best Assassin's Creed villain we've ever had. He's not just twiddling his his fingers and his thumbs and yeah. <laughs> For me? Wow. What a champ. Wait, are we done with that sequence? Is that seven complete? That's seven completed, I guess. No, it's not. Like we can still go back to seven. See what I mean? There must be more to have. Or is, did we just finish six and now we're on to seven? Two penny and lose. The Templars are far from defeat. Jacob and Evie have killed two of Crawford Sterick's agents. Philip, Two Penny, and Lucy Thorne, but the Templars are far from defeated. A conspiracy to assassinate the Prime Minister take James over the House of Parliament, and despite Evie's triumph over Lucy Thorne, uh, the quest for the Shroud of England takes a dramatic turn. Let's do it, boys! Dear Mr. Starrick, men hired. Strike tomorrow. Disraeli's death will stall Corrupt Practices Act indefinitely. Gladstone will be far more pliable. 
May the father, etc., etc. B. So Sterek's got his finger in politics, has he? I need to enter the Sinopian Club and find out who B is. Sinopian? Around Parliament. As if I don't usually. Your indiscretion at the Bank of England caused British currency to nearly collapse. Nearly is the opposite. It's fine, Evie will come in and sweep Speaking up the mess. Collapses. What of the key you found that unlocks very little? Henry took it for research. I am confident that the vault is ours. Nearly ours, Evie. Nearly. A letter. For me. We'll get around to that eventually. Fantastic. Well, folks, I think we're going to have to call it here because I've been recording for almost an hour. I need to actually see how this footage turned out. Until next time, though, thank you folks for watching. God bless you, and I'll see you later. Bye!